I was never the one to write up a song for just anyone I, I was always the one to find myself lost in all conversations Oh, cause I've always been told that things will unfold if you keep on waiting But then you came along and proved me all wrong, I was so mistaken Cause you glue all the pieces back together Yeah you, you take all my wrongs and make them better yeah, you, you're making me wanna try forever And I feel so free, oh my sweet baby Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am so excited to give you a full room tour of our four-year-old son's bedroom. This is the first room that we've renovated in our new house. We moved in about two months ago and it's been so nice to make at least one of the rooms feel like it's our home. And it's got us really excited for the whole project. We have so much else to do, um, but it's been a great start. So I'm really pleased with how it's all turned out. I can't actually take all the credit for this though. We did use an interior designer for the first time ever and I'm so pleased with the products that she chose and I'll link as many of them as I can in the description down below but I think I'll just walk you around like you're here with me so let's go so as you walk up the stairs in our house his room is actually the first thing that you see so we wanted this wall to be a bit of a focal point and a play area as well so we did change the wallpaper in this room there was a like a gray color before and we got this from a place called Levette's wallpaper came all the way from America then we've got a little bit of storage here for him to like grab it's like the perfect height for him as well so we got this piece of hanging storage from Etsy and we've put a few bits in here like his flashcards a trolls memory game and his Peppa Pig toys as well and then we also got this peg shelf we had it made to the size that we wanted and then we got these little storage baskets from not on the high street Street. they say one two three four and then they also say it in Spanish and we've got a few bits in there like I couldn't believe how much we could fit in them actually we've got this entire train set in this one we've got his stickle bricks all of these like little toys and we've also got his blocks I also love this knitted wire um, of his name it's just so cute so unique so we've just sat it on top of the shelf here we also have a hanging plant in his room which adds a bit of greenery and draws your eye up and we love the way that it looks and then we also have some prints all of the prints in his room are from Desenio and Desenio have actually sponsored this section of the video so a huge thank you to them and they've also said that my viewers can have an amazing discount. So I'll put all the details in the description down below. They're basically having a 25% off sale, but with my link, you can get an extra 10% off on prints. And we love Desenio because they're constantly updating their collections. They have something for literally everyone and every style. They also have a really cool gallery tool on their website. So if you're planning a gallery wall, it really helps you to visualize how it's gonna look and like plan your interior design and they also ship worldwide so even if you're in the US and you order from them you'll get it within five working days they just have so much selection for any room and we really loved the kids prints so for Jackson we got this whale print with a giraffe and a moon and we went for a black frame which is also from Desenio and then we also got this adventure print because there's a bit of an adventure theme going on throughout his room um, but we actually went for a wooden frame and then we also got a really cute little bear print as well and he's holding like loads of balloons and penguins um, so I'll show you that in a minute but again if you want to check it out I'll put the discount in my description down below um, and all my old time viewers will remember this moose from Caleb's bedroom Caleb has passed it down this was originally from Loaf but like five years ago it's very old uh, but we love him <laughs> so he's there as well then over in this corner we got the most adorable canopy I love the idea 
idea of a canopy in a kid's bedroom because it could be a tent to play in, it could be a reading corner. Um, so we got this from Scandi Bourne. It's in like an olive color and we've just hung it from a hook on the ceiling. And then below it, we've got a little buffet which he could sit on and like read a book. Or I was thinking I could also drag it over to his bed and read him a book. It's like a place for me to sit as well. And this was from Nordic Nest. And then we got this little snake because it was the perfect colors um, of his room. And then we also got this from Scandi Bourne. It's like a really soft velvet pillow. And because it's navy blue, it kind of pulls in the color of the bed, which I'll show you in a sec. Um, and also the wallpaper as well. Then in Jackson's room, he has one huge window and we struggled to know what to do in terms of blinds or shutters. But in the end, we didn't get shutters because he gets the most beautiful sunrise in his room and we didn't want to like take away from that. So we got a blackout roller blind. We got electric like we had in our old house. We really love that. It's nice to have no cords as well in kids' rooms. Um, and we got it from a place called All Kinds of Blinds. It was the only place we could find that would make one like as wide um, as as we needed. So you just literally press a button and it comes down. And since having it installed, we have also realized that it makes the perfect projector screen for movie nights. We also got this little tiger rainbow hanging, which we've just popped there. And then we ended up changing the radiator in his room. The last one wasn't giving off much heat. So we went for a very classic column rad um, and we got like nickel valves as well. We're trying to keep things that are gonna stay in the house for a long time as classic as possible. And then doing more modern twists on things that we can change like as trends change. And then if you come over here, we've got a little bit more toy storage. There's these two little suitcases is. Um, and inside I've literally just put a few bits like he loves building with these little bricks and then also his favorite toy. It's got all his Shopkins in there so he can just get out his toys when he wants to. I also wanted to show you his new bed. We went for a bunk bed and it's from a place called Room to Grow. And I've had a few questions as to why we got him a bunk bed, but it's for a few different reasons. When family and friends can travel again, we would love to have my sister and my niece and nephew over to stay. And if we do ever have guests, all three of our boys could sleep in this room because it's actually a bunk bed with trundle. And that is also quite handy because we're gonna live here during the renovation and at one point the other boys rooms will be being done up and we might actually need all three of the boys to share this room for a few months. Um, so it's exciting and they've actually already had a few sleepovers and because we can do the projector onto his blind, they're also calling it Jackson's cinema room. They come in here and they watch movies and it's really cute. They're so excited about it. Um, so yeah, that was from Room to Grow. And then the sheets on the bed we got from a place called AD and Harry and there's little dinosaurs on the top bunk and there's little rocket ships on the bottom bunk. And then his little side table is from a place called Cuckoo Land. So we can keep some things in here. And then this little monkey light, which I just love. It's from a place called Graham and Green. I shared it on Instagram and everyone that saw it uh, had such a different opinion on it. It was very divided. So I love it, but I know it's not for everyone, but I just think he's so cute. Um, then we also put some bunting on his bed and there's a really cool light on the top bunk as well so it actually pulls out so if someone is on the top bunk they can turn on their own light and do some reading if they want to and it's just a really cute feature then at the end of his bed on this wall, we have three clear Ikea shelves. They're so brilliant. And we have displayed some of his favorite books on these shelves. We've also got um, this Desenio print up here. And it's so nice that he can just access these, but then it also brings some color into the room. And then down here, we've got some more toy storage. We got this from a place called Soren's House and you can actually put it on wheels. So it says superhero on it. And we're actually keeping all of his fancy dress in there, him and Caleb, particularly love fancy dress. So we've got all that like accessible for them. And then we also got this little like house storage. It looks like a little house, but it is a bag for like all of his soft toys and he really loves soft toys. So we've got all of them in here. And then Jackson has the most incredible built-in storage, which was already in his room, but we decided to spray them white. And then we also updated the handles on these wardrobes. They were these like old fashioned silver handles, but we've gone for these like black um, brushed chrome handles, which look 
really good. So these two, like behind these two doors here is actually all of Matt's stuff. Until we build our room, Matt's keeping some of his stuff in here, um, but eventually Jackson can have it. Um, but at the moment in here, is all of Jackson's clothes. So we actually put um, a set of drawers in here. Then we've got some baskets and a few bits hanging as well. And then in the final cupboard, we have like the kids um, book library. Having three kids means we have quite the collection <laughs> from over the years, but also a lot of these books are from when I was a kid. My mum actually gave me all my books um, when I grew up. So yeah, they've got a huge selection in here. And if Caleb wants one, he can come in here and get one as well. Um, so yeah, that's his storage. And lastly, I wanted to show you his new light. Before, there was a big chandelier in his room, which actually hung quite low. So we changed it for this higher light, which is from Maid. It's actually a bathroom light, but we think it works really well in his room. Right, so that is it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Jackson is thrilled with his new room. Him and his brothers have been playing in here so much already. And if you do like my home content, I would love you to follow me over on Instagram. We've actually started a home Instagram account. So it's just all content about like our interior choices and it's at Emily Norris Home. Um, but yeah, with all that said, thank you so much and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.